Hey, what's up everyone? Danny here. Today we're going to talk about dexterity, strength and dexterity in your hands, your fingers, as well as your toes and your feet. Okay, this is important stuff for mixed martial arts, Muay Thai, all kinds of combat sports. This is super important and we have to talk about this. So that's what we're going to cover it today. All right, so Today I'm going to talk about a couple of exercises, stuff you can do off the mat. Off the mat means anytime before, after classes, at home, on the weekends, okay? Um, you don't have to do this every single day, but once in a while it's important to, all right? So dexterity means how you have that dexterity within your fingers, your hands, because in jiu-jitsu we use the hands for our grips, in Muay Thai we use the hands for our fists, um, your feet, your toes, all right? So good balance, a lot of the balance we do when we do knees and kicks, uh, footwork comes from the placement of our feet, but also tracking on the mats with our toes. All right, so today I'm going to cover a few exercises, simple stuff you can do to strengthen your toes, your grips in your feet, as well as strengthen your fingers, the grips in your hands. So the first exercise I'm showing here is you're only going to use uh, some elastics, right? So you grab some elastics that you have at home. So I use two small ones, and what we're doing here is just grabbing the elastic wrapping it around your fingers and spreading your fingers out, all right? Nice and slow and do repetitions like this. So use 10 to 15 reps and just spread your fingers like this, all right? You're gonna feel it in your fingers, in your hands, as well as your forearms. This is great to strengthen the grips and really opening up the dexterity into our hands and our fingers. We're gonna do on the same side, we're gonna do 10 to 15 on our right and then switch the elastics to your left and do 10 to 15 reps on the opposite side as well. Second exercise I'm showing here is I'm just grabbing some small weights, just the plates, all right? So the way I'm using it right now is just grabbing it, letting everything dangle at the tip of my fingers, almost like I'm gonna drop the weights. And now from here, I start to curl slowly up, but when you get to the top, don't close your fists, just use the fingers. Four fingers are curling the weights and bring it back down slowly, always curling up and back down, using only the fingers and not curling at the wrist, all right? If you start curling at the wrist, then you're gonna start to put more emphasis on curling on the forearms. What we wanna do is the dexterity and the strength in the fingers, so only roll the fingers up and slowly unroll them down. Next exercise here, I have a ball, so we're gonna hold a ball in our hand. Now we're gonna start to squeeze the ball and release the tension. Squeeze the ball as hard as you can and release the tension. Now try not to squeeze with the power of your forearms, but more about squeezing with your fingers, all right? Almost like an eagle claw. So you're really squeezing with the fingers and then letting go the tension and do 10 to 15 on one side and then switch sides, do 10 to 15. You can do multiple sets as well. Now we're gonna start to focus on the toes, the feet, the dexterity there. So the first one here, I'm just uh, putting my toes inside a small kettlebell. You can use a sandbag, or elastic bands, it doesn't really matter, just something to give you some tension. And now we're just gonna do weighted foot flexes. So here, we're gonna strengthen our feet, the dexterity in our toes, as well as strengthen the ankles and the anterior tibialis. So here we're just doing 10 to 15 on one side, then you'll switch and do the same thing on your left. Next one here, we're gonna grab a towel, put it on the floor, and as you can see here, I'm just curling my toes. Imagine I wanna crawl the towel and bundle up. So this one here, every time I bundle the towel, I'm flexing the dexterity in my toes and the muscles in my feet, all right? So this is a really good one. This will strengthen your feet and that gripping when you grip the mats for some judo and jiu-jitsu as well. Now, another one for the feet and toes is toe raises off a weight plate. So here, you can do it in a staircase. I'm just using a weighted plate. So heels on the plate, and now it's almost like doing a calf raise, but the opposite of it. So we're just gonna raise up, flex the toes, and come back down, and then raise up on your heels, flex the toes, and come back down. Combining with this, we're gonna go toes in. So we're gonna bring the toes towards the inside, and then bring them back out towards the inside, and this is really gonna strengthen the muscles in your feet, dexterity, as well as strengthen your ankles. And the last one we're gonna do is the same thing, but we're gonna go toes out. Bring your feet towards the outside, and bring it back in, and go slowly and flex, and go towards the outside, and then back in. All right, guys, there you have it. A few exercises to strengthen the grips in your hands, as well as strengthen the grips in your feet. 
Guys, we hope you enjoyed this type of content. Until next time, I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.